Hey, good morning. Are you feeling a little groggy <laughs> even after a good night's sleep? Hey, don't worry. It's not just because it's 615 in the morning. <laughs> if your energy is just not what it used to be, there are other possible reasons for your exhaustion, apparently. Yeah, Channel 2's health reporter Haley Hernandez is joining us with a health alert this morning. She's taking a look at those odd reasons you're so tired. Most of us blame stress or food on our restless nights, but there could be other reasons causing you to feel tired. Yes, caffeine is a great morning pick me up, but it tends to dehydrate you, which can drain your energy, especially in the mornings when you're already a little dehydrated. Drinking eight ounces of water with your morning cup of Joe could help prevent this. If phlegm tends to build up in the back of your throat while you sleep, you may be compensating by breathing through your mouth, which means your lungs are not getting enough oxygen. This can lead to fatigue, so in the morning, help clear the throat's phlegm with mouthwash or salt water and take a few deep breaths to boost your energy. Comfortable clothing may be making you more tired as well. Baggy and stretchy clothes make it easy to slouch, which means your body has to work harder to circulate oxygen. Also, the color of your clothing matters. Dark colors like black, navy, and brown tend to stimulate melatonin, a brain chemical that makes you sleepy. But white clothes suppress melatonin and boost serotonin. Red stimulates adrenal glands, and yellow has been proven to stimulate the brain and build self-confidence. If your energy level is unusually low, get your blood checked for things like anemia or hypothyroidism. Certain heart and lung problems also cause fatigue. Haley Hernandez, KPRC Channel 2 News. Well, what I took away from that whole report is it's time.